We smoked all these ham hocks yesterday. Give them a nice good smoky flavor. Cook them in with all the peas, all the garlic, green onions, celery, lots of fresh thyme. Traditionally, it's all cooked in with the rice, but we're gonna put it all folded into the rice later. Some jalapenos, add a little bit of heat. Most places, traditionally, you won't even find any peppers in here at all. Just ham hocks, thyme, black eyed peas, rice. We're gonna saute all of this. The celery, the ham hocks. And then add the peas and the stock into it, chicken stock. So the ham hocks are all nice and tender, kind of falling apart. The beans and the black eyed peas are nice and tender. That's uh, celery, peppers, and onions. Next step is get it all cooking. And this nice skillet, hot skillet full of olive oil. So now we're going to add some ham hocks. These have been smoked yesterday. Even though these are already cooked and already smoked off, we're going to brown them up a little bit more in the oil. Put that nice flavor in the oil before we saute our vegetables. This right here is our chicken stock. It's got lots of bay leaf in it. A couple of chili peppers just before we do it. Now that these are all browned off in the oil, I'm going to remove them. So we can make room for our vegetables. Nice brown ham hocks. Now the oil's got nice hammy flavor in there. We're going to add our celery. Onions, green peppers. All of these uh, vegetables are getting sauteed. They're loosening up all the nice, hammy little bits from the ham hocks. We're going to add some garlic to it. Healthy amount of garlic. Okay, now that our uh, onions and celery, peppers, and garlic are all nicely sauteed in that flavor of oil. Put the ham hocks back in. We're going to add all of our black eyed peas that we soaked overnight to remove any impurities. Mix that in a little. And we're going to add our stock. This is chicken stock with bay leaves. Put a chili pepper in there just for the fun of it. Add a little fresh thyme right now. More fresh thyme at the end. Some freshly ground black pepper and also some red pepper flakes. A delicious popping John to bring you good luck in 2012.